The three-year tradition continues. It's hard to imagine it's been three years already since the 2015 edition of NFPA 70E was published. The 2018 edition is right around the corner. As in the past, there are many changes in this new edition. I developed a two-DVD program to cover the uh, most important and the, and the major changes. And one of the changes that I want to talk about here is about the 40 calorie per square centimeter informational note found in 130.7a. Personal and other protective equipment, just in general, this is a big one. So there was a note that stated that if the calculated incident energy exceeds 40 calories a square centimeter, additional emphasis or greater emphasis should be given to de-energizing. And this particular informational note, informational note three, is what often led to some interesting arc flash labels. Quite often, if the calculated energy exceeded 40 calories a square centimeter, rather than using an orange background with warning, it would change to a red background with danger, and quite often it would list no PPE available. And that's not really quite right because PPE arc ratings go well beyond 100 calories per square centimeter. And the problem was that 40 calories per square centimeter, although that's a lot of incident energy, many were thinking that this was kind of a threshold where it would be more explosive. And the explosiveness of an arc flash isn't so much based on the incident energy. It's more a function of short circuit current. For example, if you have 40 calories per square centimeter, and that occurs over two or three electrical cycles, yeah, there's, there's going to be quite a bit of an explosive force with that. But if you have 40 calories per square centimeter, just because a protective device took a long time to operate, perhaps 60 cycles, maybe 90 cycles, some big number, 40 calories per square centimeter over an extended period of time, that's not going to be as explosive. And so this informational note was actually deleted, and for good reason, because instead, a greater emphasis should always be placed on de-energizing, not just because the calculated incident energy goes above 40 calories per square centimeter.